Greetings and welcome to another uh, Adobe from scratch. Just a quick tip here. It's something everybody needs to know for lots of reasons. You you want to resize the image or you want to email it. Uh, it's too big. Uh, you want to put it on your website. You want to put it on Facebook, your YouTube site or whatever. Okay, so lots of things that you need to resize images for so it's you know it's a very simple thing first off we got this image here of the Orion uh, Nebula and it is huge it is 6,000 by 6,000 pixels way too big to do anything with as far as emailing or I mean it'd be great for printing you know if you wanted to print it but uh, as far as putting it on a website or anything like that, it's way too big. It's several million, um, several million bytes. So, so this is easy. Let's go here. You know, here it is. You go up to image, and I, I wanted to show you this first. Now, check out down here. It's 8.33 percent of the size. If I were to put this thing at 100 percent it's it's off the charts I mean look at the size of this thing you know it is just massive okay and the same here with your left to right this is not resizing this is just resizing your view see I put this back down to 8.33 percent that's just resizing the view that's not resizing the image itself so there we go so there it is back now to actually resize it you need to go to image while it's selected you go to image and image size it's very simple very easy to find and you can see it's 6,000 by 6,000 this thing is huge and we don't want that. Let's say, you know, you're going to put it on Facebook. 900 by 900, that's good. Now you notice when I change the width, the height automatically changed. And that's because you got um, constrained proportions on down here. And you, you want that on. And you hit OK. And there it is. And it's tiny, but it's tiny because you're still down here at 8.33 percent now if you bring it up to a hundred percent see it's it's still bigger than my screen here because I have my screen set down to 1280 by 720 for the tutorials so um, let's just look at this say at 75 percent and remember this is not resizing this is just resizing your view not your image uh, still a little bit big I'm going to go on down to 50 just to get it over with there you go there's your image at 900 by 900 you file save as you might want to do a save as so that you don't overwrite your original if you want to keep that big image that you brought into your computer from your camera or wherever you got it and you want to keep that original then don't just hit save hit save as okay now I wanted to show you something else I'm gonna make this image smaller say say you've you've got an image that's 450 by 450 and we can crank that up to a hundred percent so we can see it now it's 450 by 450 and that's what it is now so if I were and when you resize Photoshop does a great job at going down and compared to most image processing software Photoshop does a great job at going up but nothing is good going up I mean I'm, I'm gonna show you here and it's still gonna look pretty pretty good but if I try to take this up now you know say I brought the image in you know I got it off the internet or something like that 
and I brought it in and it was only 450 by 450 and then I want it to be say you know 1200 by 1200 uh, I'll show you what we get here and you, it's not really that noticeable because like I said Photoshop does a great job at even going up but if you go up far enough let's take it back to the 6000 by 6000 now check that out it's it's full of it's trashy it's full of artifacts um, let's get over here into some color you see you see these lines it's it's really unattractive I'm gonna go back to the original and at 6,000 okay let's trash all this now see here it is back at 6,000 again and let's see if we can find that same line that we were looking at this is close enough you see that that's that's still nice and I'm just gonna zoom out and you can see you know that it's very crisp but you you want to try to avoid taking images up in size that don't really work out now like I said Photoshop is good at doing that so if you want to do it fine go ahead um, chances are if you don't go too far up most people aren't going to notice but again just real quick summarization image size is 6000 you want to put it on Facebook you take it down to 900 and there you go and we'll crank this back up uh, to 100 percent for the viewing and there you go and it looks great Photoshop is excellent with with resizing um, and make sure you do a save as like I said so you don't overwrite your original unless you don't want your original okay so that's it for image resizing it's very simple and thanks for watching see you again